all right youtube what's going on it's a video short easy the way i like it if you got this problem this is a 2019 bmw x3 and we have a code right there compressor shut down to excess pressure on the system on the ac system you're going crazy checking everything out you change the pressure valve ac pressure valve what is it uh, it's right over there right there and you have the same problem I'm going crazy you cannot leave a no cannot sleep at night going to a whole bunch of uh people who work with ac they cannot find the problem you may want to check your auxiliary water pump this is the one for it for turbo and the other one that is the same one This is your condenser, AC condenser. And the water pump is right over here. Let me see if I can find it right here. You can see my hand right here. This one right here. The plugs are the same. So if you switch your plug, your turbo auxiliary water pump is not gonna turn on. So that means your AC is gonna be always hot and it's gonna be in some pressure because you got your AC compressor pumping and turn on, turn it off, turn on, turn it off and you're gonna have hot air and almost 500 PSI of pure pressure on the AC system so this wire right here the one of like a L shape goes over there down there on the AC condenser water pump coolant and this one right here that is goes all the way from back there all the way here that it will reach either pump both cable will reach either pump so if you took the engine out like we did and we went crazy with this AC stopped working and everything I'm like oh my god this one over here the plug that is you know straight goes right here and that's it man easy fix well now it's easy fix because we know it we spend almost a week checking doing testing going to another AC specialized mechanic and they was going crazy we changed twice the AC uh, pressure sensor and you know we keep having the same problem and that wire bothers me because it was like a huge shape. I'm like, why that wire is so long? Why, why, why? So I said, you know what? I'm gonna change it. So we change it and with this scanner, we turn on the um, turbo auxiliary pump and it didn't, this one didn't start. It started the one on the bottom of the condenser. So we know right there, man, that had to be it. Because if we don't have uh, water running, it's gonna get heat and it's gonna build some pressure. And voila. All right, guys, I don't like to do videos like I always said. I just posted because I, you know, I found this and nobody knew about it. And I like to help people, you know how it is. So I hope this helped. Peace.